I'll second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Item two is open requests for quotations for the DPW fuel island uh, repairs. We have two here. First one's from Northwest. $6,083.12. This, this one's from Waltz. $26,495.12. Mark, do you need to look at these at all? Um, I guess I'd like to review and take a look at the timelines and everything as far as what this is. And I can make a recommendation at next week's meeting, or is this one of those things where you have to take a little bit? Yeah, I mean, I, I guess. Um, I guess with the construction, I guess we, you know, unless there's a legitimate reason not to, that we take the low bid. So, mm -hmm. um, I, I'd make a motion to move ahead with the low bid of Northwest Petroleum. A second. And then, if you have any significant issues or anything, you can bring it back. Okay, Mark. Is that any other uh, discussion? All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Great. There you go. Thank Thanks, Mark. <coughs> Item three: open request for proposals for the chiller replacement. Can you give Marianne one of those? Yes. Can already have one. Okay. We have four. First one's from August Winter. Uh, $33,722. Uh, next is from Complete Control. Forty-seven thousand four hundred fifty dollars. Next is from EGI Mechanical. Twenty-four thousand three hundred dollars. Next is from Forefront. Mechanical. $32,450. Make a motion to move ahead with EGI Mechanical at $24,300. A second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay. Item number four, open bids for the protective glass partition and installation project. We have one. Glass uh, on the 
front, $43,853. I'll make a motion to approve um, glass, $43,853. i will second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Item 5 is Owasa Fire Station, number 2, building, sure, construction, pay estimate number 13. I move to approve. I'll second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Item 6 is the Wassa Fire Station, number 2. The site, the sunrise trucking and excavating, pay estimate number 10. We have had um, some difficulty, or Myron has, getting sunrise back to do their work in the punch list items. Um, right now, we do have retainage from them for just under $25,000 after this pay request. So um, the question is, do we pay this because this is at work that's actually been done and just hold retainage until they get back mm -hmm. and if we have to bring somebody else in or do we hold this payment? I think under the contracts typically if the work's actually been done and approved we need, we to, need to make them. the payment Yep. and then the retainage is for if we have to bring somebody else in to do the work. Tracy have you heard anything um, different? No I have I have not heard a thing. Okay. You know, the, the cement work was done okay. um, back, in, back in May. It's just uh, the other things that he hasn't come back with the, with the punch work. So, um, okay. The remaining retainers would, would cover being able to hire somebody else out if he, if he never decided to come back. And there are no penalties for... <clears throat> your number of days like we do with street projects in the contract was there anything like that in the contract there, there could be I don't know what the final completion dates are on this oh, okay. so I don't I'm sure that there is but I don't I don't I'm not as familiar with that contract so for liquidated damages yeah, yeah. I just didn't know if the 25,000 would cover those or if we should be uh, mm. you know if yeah. we should be deducting a retainage for their lateness because I know Holly from Myron <clears throat> did send something to them and gave them a deadline for the end of this week to mm. come back, or we would pursue bringing somebody else in to do the work. Uh, liquidated damages, I don't know. So mm -hmm. maybe we want to wait until we can check that, though. I okay. think that's a good point. We should have that prepared before the next meeting. What the completion deadline is and what the amount of the retainage would be and what's left to pay on the contract so we know that we're withholding the amount we're entitled mm -hmm. to withhold. So we could bring this back next week then, Lauren? Okay. Okay. So we'll hold this, <clears throat> bring it back next week. All right. Item 7 is the Wassa Fire Station number 2 fire protection from Apex Fire Protection. This is their final payment. I move to approve. I'll second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Item 8, Sawasa Fire Station number 2, Plumbing Stainless Specialist, pay estimate number 10 and final payment. There's two payments here. I'll make a motion to approve. I'll second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. The Wasa Fire Station number two HVAC stainless specialist final payment. Make a motion to approve. A second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. And item 10, Wasa Fire Station number two electrical, PGA Incorporated, pay estimate number 12, pay estimate 13, and final payment. Three payments. I'd make a motion to approve. I'll second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. I'm really having a good time here. <laughs> <laughs> Switching those down. 
I wish it was a beer, though. <laughs> <laughs> uh, item 11 is a 2019 business campus drainage project, Merrill Gravel and Construction, final payment. I believe this was just a re release retainage. Project is done satisfactorily. Make a motion to approve. I'll second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 And item number 12 is a 2020 Fulton Street extension. Haas Sons Incorporated is change order three. This is a couple of electrical items to add a couple of outlets <clears throat> and run an extra wire to two poles that were wasn't called out on the plan. But um, when Rick Pravelski reviewed it, I figured we might as well have those outlets up there in case we want to hang Christmas lights in the future. So this, I think, was like $1,400 yeah. for a couple of outlets and some extra wire. The pricing was in line with the contracts we'd recommend approval. Make a motion to approve. I'll second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Last one. Make a motion to adjourn. I'll second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Thanks, Tracy.